is incredible. Look at all of you. This is amazing. Thank you so much. Wow. Friends, we made history today. We made history today. You know, when I was growing up as a kid, when I was growing up, I could have never imagined someone like me ever running to be prime minister. Well, guess what? Well, guess what? We just told a lot of kids out there that yes, you can. Yes, yes you can. Uh, what are you gonna do now to uh, reverse the sagging polling numbers for the NDP nationally? Well, what we're gonna do is get to work. We're gonna fight for people and show them that they don't have to put up with a government in Ottawa that's too busy handing out gifts to FNC Lavalin, to the pharmaceutical industry, continuing to subsidize oil and gas. Instead, they can choose to have the new Democrats who will fight for them be on their side, be in their corner. You have faced a lot of internal criticism over the low fundraising, over low support in the polls. How are you going to bring your caucus and your party together behind you now? Well, I believe, and, I, and I've spent time um, with people at the doorsteps, and it's clear to me that all new Democrats are committed to making sure that people in their riding, their voices and their concerns are brought to Ottawa. And we're all united. We're all, we're all united in that vision. There are risks in um, uh, slagging SNC-Lavalin. It may play in Burnaby South. Is there a risk that it could cost you support in uh, Quebec, where many Quebecers work for the company? Well, even uh, Canadians across this country, including Quebecers, don't believe we should be giving preferential treatment to one corporation that if you're well-connected and powerful, you can just call up the Prime Minister and have them change the laws to get you off the hook. No one believes that's a good way to run a country, and Quebecers also don't believe that that's the way we should run a country.